Hello and welcome to Shadowgate. Oh man, what a game. Um, before I start, just gonna say that I'm currently ill, so I might sound different and I'll try to refrain from coughing. Um, but yeah, what a game this is. Holy crap, I remember playing this um, on uh, vaguely on the NES, but I used to play quite a lot on the Game Boy. Um, a hero's journey, a great quest. Hmm. Certainly, it shall be these things. But for you, young Jayakathaka, soldier of Windermere, could it not be so much more? In dreams, I have come to you, beseeching, entreating. Ride south, boy. Take naught but a dirk, a torch, courage. Ride south from Rivelin, around the southern arm, through the Waven Fairwood, past Myrithsath, beyond the citadel of Murlac Tor, and the spires of Gimdane, and the darkness of Tarketh's Pass. This looks amazing. Wow. There you shall find my stone in wait. Under the shade of the mountain range, none have entered. Either on foot, on mount, on wing. Gatekeeper, the oldest of spires. It harbors that which has been spoken of in whispers and ascribed to legend. Shadow Gate. The Living Castle. Oh, the artwork looks amazing. Wow. I don't but wait all to play is this. not as it should be. One of our own is now our great bane. A blight upon us. He has brought the ancient keep low. And it now lies fallow. It is there that you will find me. Blackmere of the Circle of Twelve. It is there that you will find this great quest. It is there that you will find yourself. That was so cool. Ah, oh, look at this. Look how nice it looks. So, for those that don't know, Shadowgate is a uh, point and click game. Uh, where basically you have to get through the uh, the living castle, Shadowgate. Um, uh, Black mirrors, words echoing about your head. You stumble a bit until the words is blah blah blah. All right. Okay. So that just sounds. Okay. So the controls used to be a bit funny on the uh, on the Game Boy that I played it quite long because it was a bit awkward to to do. Um, but this looks nice. Wow. Um, okay, so. Uh, I can't remember actually where you. I'm guessing you just open. No way to open the skull. I'm not trying to open the skull. Ah. You call me Yorick. I have no recollection of how I got here. I do know plenty about this castle. Okay. I'm gonna take that key. That's not how it used to be. I remember there used to be a little slot above the door. Um, so. Use. Um, the door. Okay, so I do have to actually do the open thing. Uh, use the door. What? No. Oh man, this is not as easy as I remember. Okay. Blackmere was a fool to send a child to do that which even the vaunted Circle of Twelve could not. Contain my growing power. Come if you wish. It makes little difference. 
Seal your fate within this living castle of the dead. Ah, oh, man. I really remember the, um, how everything used to look. It looks amazing. I'm pretty sure you can actually change it to retro as well. Which is kind of cool. Um, but I'm not going to. Because I like the look of this. So. Um. I remember there being a book stand here last time. No. A circular hatch is made of strange stone set securely within the mod base. Um, I'm pretty sure you can take this as well. Because you need to keep an eye on your torch. Um, uh, what's this? Nature wouldn't leave it. Can I use it? Um, maybe open. Can't open the lever. Hit it. Aha! So, let's take the key. to be a trap. Ah, this is what I was on about the, the book. So, you can't actually take the book, but you can open it, if I remember. Uh, in Vulcan. In your mind's eye, you see a glyph glowing with power, and quickly write down the strange markings in your spell book. You have learned a spell. Uh, I cannot remember what that does, actually. Uh, what's this thing? What's gonna happen if I take this? Okay. Open. Let's have a look at it. You read the message scrawled on the scroll. Uh, don't really know how to pronounce that. This missive is the of utmost importance. Um okay. Okay, so let's have a look at this guy. I'm bad feeling about this. How do we save? Okay. So let's do a quick save. <clears throat> so let's, uh, let's eat the skeleton. <laughs> yeah, it's not really can cannibalism. He's already kind of dead, and there's not much on him. Um, so go maybe. I'm able to go to the skeleton. Take. Decide to let the dead be. Open. Ah, here we are. Pat down the corpse, your rough handling produces the sound of crackling bones. Oh, hello? It suddenly comes to life, boo. Um, okay. Let's have a look at this. This brittle parchment contains naught but a faded illustration of and five words. Seek ye the black axe. Well, that was never in the original. Okay, so, uh, I take one of these. I'll take them both. <coughs> Sorry. Um, where do I go from here? Can I go this way? Ah, yes. Ah, oh, I kind of remember this room. Um, so... A hand stitch sack is made from the hide of an animal. Which animal, however, is inserted? Uh, can I open it? Okay, good. So, you rummage through the sack, finding dice, scroll, and a gear. 
Um, let's have a look. Moons and glyphs. Um, okay. So, if I remember rightly, there's a trapdoor in this in this room somewhere, or not. Teeth chattering, you stand within the cold cellar, looking yourself for warmth. The creature made of ice hovers playfully on the far side of the room. This was never in the original, so... Um... Maybe use the torch on Okay. They have added stuff into this, it seems, because there is some stuff I don't remember. I remember this corridor a bit, um, um, I'm going to save it because I remember there being, okay, I remember there being something wrong with these. of a huge hulking figure. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's got something in it. You can't take the mummy. I remember the things. Oh! Yeah, you... I remember. Okay, use it. No. Okay, use... Yeah! I remember that. The ancient weapons go up in flames, an amazing gold ske scepter? scepter, and leather sack fall to the ground. Okay, so there's nowhere to um, maybe just take them in. and then open that. Okay, so let's open these up and have a look at them. While the writing is difficult to, to screen, you Manage to glean a few key phrases. The danger is real. Alert the surrounding lands. Seal off the passages to the gatekeeper mountains. Um, okay. Let's have a look at this one. Knowing it might be important, you carefully unscroll it. The handwritten scroll is faded and difficult to read, but you can make out one passage. Uh, lights not in the sky. The alignments are in the... What? <laughs> um... Okay, so... I keep not meaning to do that. So... It's welded to the bracket. Is that the one? Yeah. Okay. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Can I take that one? One as well, maybe. Okay. Punch the torch with a squeal of protest. If it was downwards, it's metal bracket. Does that mean I can take this one? So I'm pretty sure one of these opening one of these was a problem before. Um, as if I go down here. Huh. I remember this room. This... I think these are all mirrors, aren't they? Let's have a look. Yeah, okay. Your head looks much larger than the rest of your body. I'm pretty sure you can open one of these, but I think it's... Uh, there used to only be... Five, I think. Okay. What do you want? 
Once knew a wizard who knew how to make this castle come alive, Yorick says, but apparently he's dead now. Sorry, lad. You're very much help. So, can I take that broom? Can I take it? Okay. Um. What do you want now? Boy, you better be paying attention to that failed torch you're holding. If I might give you some advice, make sure you have enough unlit ones to light before it goes out. Oh, right, okay, yeah. I kind of remember that. Okay. Pretty sure you could use that too. Never mind. all say the same thing. My dashing figure. <coughs> so they all are different. If you look at the reflection in the mirror, it borders out a bit as if something is pushing from the other side. That must be the one that's open, so I can't remember how to open it. Um, let's have a look at the other ones. Although dusty, the surface of the mirror is cast a fine reflection of yourself. Catch the movement behind a reflection. You jump back in surprise before looking around the room. The surface on this mirror appears warped in an odd way. Either that or your hips are really big. Okay, so if I remember right, you can't go down there because not without a rope anyway. With the exception of a crack, the vial is unremarkable in nearly every way. Okay. Vaguely remember this bit. I find myself on the shore of a placid underground, underground lake. Um. <clears throat> Pretty sure that you have to freeze that somehow. Magnificent waterfall cascades from the mouth of an ancient stone statue, painstakingly carved into a cavern wall. Below it is an un. un what? Undulating? Mass of water hovers playfully above the river. Okay. Let's quickly save it. Okay. So, what is that? I cut the. Burrow into the rock, this cavern, moving on river bushes, and cast to the river. Pretty sure you can go behind this. to go from here actually I can't remember I always used to get stuck at this bit like on the original um, 
Okay, you know what? I think I'll end this episode here, but I will definitely keep playing this because it's so cool and it looks so much nicer now. Uh, in fact, let's have a look at what it used to look like. Oh yeah, that music. Wow. Oh no. Does it not? No? Not show sure what it used to look like? No? Oh well. Okay, so yeah, I'm going to end this one here, but I will definitely be coming back to it. Okay, thanks for watching guys, see you later.